everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls series. It is the morning of day 100. I took yesterday, so this was last week, uh, when I recorded last. I think I took the whole day yesterday to go ahead and fix the base. It looks like that's what I did. Yeah, I put some blocks in down here. Okay, so the last thing I think you saw is we put these turrets in. We ran the horde. It went fairly well. I think I got most of the stuff repaired. Looks like I did. Looks like I repaired most things here. Yeah. So, and then what else did I do? I don't think I updated the base in any real meaningful way. There's a bit of damage over here, but we can fix that later on uh, before Horde. Yeah, so I didn't really make any major changes. Now, um, uh, I believe it was Anthony asked me about the sci-fi double doors if I could put those in and use them to uh, open and close going outside if it would be easier with the motorbike. It is possible. Um, so I got a couple doors going. I don't think they're powered though, so I don't think I can actually... Um, what's going on out here? Uh, did this gun go off? Let's test this gun. It should be on. No. What am I missing? Oh, wait. The door is closed, so... Where did it go? Yoi. Oh, he must have... Did he go down this way? I guess he did go down that way. I don't know. Okay, I should make some plates here. Uh, I don't have any wood. You know what? Forget it. We're, I want to go on in a, a bit of a walkabout today. I want to go down. We're going to go down uh, all the way down here. We're going to go see Trader Bob. But I want to follow this road and see. Because I think there's, like, the map kind of ends over here. But there's I think there's more towns probably along here. Because there's still a good chunk of map that we haven't explored yet. Now, I could just take off and go straight across country. But... I don't know if that, I mean, maps are generally lately laid out in grids where the towns usually appear along certain lines. So, I mean, I guess we could just kind of shoot over there, but I think I would rather go down and visit Bob, see if he's got anything good. Probably not. And then we'll go shoot over, see what we can find over here. Plus, I want to see, I can't remember, I don't think there was any libraries in his town. I want to look for books today. Um, so, yeah, that's one of the things we do want to do. Now, I, I can't remember how many we need here. I think we're halfway. Still awesome. We'll take a quick look here. Now, we've got lots of ammo. I'm not worried about how much ammo we have. Um, oh, we're almost there. Just, like, need 120 or something. So if we can find a library somewhere along the way, that's good. We're going to go take a walk around and go see what's uh, going on down there. So let's get out of here. Oh, yeah, so... I'm thinking about with this spot right here. I think I'm going to fill this in. Just like right along here. I upgraded this hatch to a steel hatch. Um, and I think I'm going to fill in the rest of this. All the way along here. And I might put a d steel door in here. So it'll just. They won't want to break through here and come through the building. Um, but that's something we got to do a little later. I'm not interested in doing that right now. We can probably do it the day of the horde. Or day after. But let's get out of here. Actually, do I have my money on me? I probably don't. No. So I tried something new. Um, a I can't remember the... Is it Mean? I think it's Mean Mad Mike made a suggestion about... I'm just going to grab all the coin. We'll leave the rest of this here. Four of those. Just in case we encounter somebody. I'll sell that other stuff later. Uh, he made a suggestion. There is a... Um, a command, a console command that you can try that would get rid of texture streaming, which might be the issue with all the bad textures we've been getting. So I did that before the episode start. So I'm interested to see as we go down here if the uh, textures are fixed because I can spend, I don't know how many episodes now, 92, something like that. We've had crappy textures on everything. It might be a bit chunky here when we first rolled out of here. But we'll see how it goes. I'm really hoping that... Let's check this car.
Nah. I don't know. Actually, that looks like it's got kind of got detail. Maybe I'm wrong. Where you really notice it is the shopping carts. As soon as I find a shopping cart, we'll check that out. So I'm not sure when the Alpha 20 is going to drop for uh, 7 Days to Die, but I think what I'm probably going to do... I don't know. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you what you think. But think what... Oh, you know what? I forgot all about this library. You know what? We're going to leave this one. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep going south. But yeah, let, there's right there. Let me know what you want me to do. If you if you want me to start playing a, a series, a regular 7 Days to Die series, but I'm having a hard time. Um... I tried going back to the regular game. It's just not as exciting as Darkness Falls. So, um, I would rather not start a series, like a, um, a game series in seven days. I, you know what, actually, I take that back. What I'm gonna do, because I've been, I've been considering what I would do if I was gonna do just like a regular seven days series again. Where's that road? It should just be over here. Um, and that would be, uh, actually, I'm not going to tell you because I don't want other people to do it. I'm going to use my um, pipe bomb base as my main base. Um, the one that I used for um, the Blasted Oasis series. Where the fuck is that road? I could just check my map, but you know me. Um, so yeah, I'm going to use my pipe bomb base as my main base. And I'm going to, like, that's going to be my main horde base and and stuff and then um because i was going to do it as an offline playthrough but i might just do it as an online playthrough just to see if it's completely viable um but i'm not going to tell you where i'm going to put it that's going to be the surprise i'm using my pipe bomb base but i'm not going to tell you where i'm going to put it so i might do a short series when it, when um alpha 20 is released and we'll see how it goes um but I, I really want to wait until Kane gets Darkness Falls stable for Alpha 20 and then do another series in Darkness Falls and Alpha 20. Because it's just so much more enjoyable. I gotta say, the Darkness Falls is just so, so much more enjoyable than the vanilla game. Don't get me wrong, I still like the vanilla game. It's just, it's kind of like when you, I don't know if you guys have ever played, is that the road? No. If you've, if you've ever played Minecraft, you know, you play the base game. And it's fun, really, really fun the first time you build stuff and it's just enjoyable, right? Because you can do anything you want, right? There's no real limits or rules or whatever. There's like, uh, yeah, there's an end game, but you don't have to do any of that. Or you can just do what you want, right? Build and create, come up with fantastic structures. It's always fun, really, like the first time when you're discovering it and it's always cool. Then you go start a new world. Eh, it's kind of still fun. Then you start another one and you're like, eh, I'm doing the same thing again. And then you're doing the same thing again and that gets real boring. Which is why modded Minecraft is so cool because, you know, you, you play a pack like the one, what is that? I think it's the 112.2 pack or something that I, I you normally play. It's got over 200 mods in it. That's the one that you start and it's never boring because you never have to do the same thing twice. Because there's just, I'm going to go right through the water. There's so many mods that it's like, oh, this playthrough I'm going to really focus on the magic stuff. Or this time I'm going to play focus on the technology stuff. Or I'm just going to build with all the cool new blocks in this one. And... You know, or I'm just going to explore in this one or whatever. So um, that's what makes it cool. And it's like you can play over and over again. That's one of the things I think I like about Darkness Falls is your characters. You don't have to play with the, um, you know, oh, I'm, I'm going to do the intellect build this time. And or I'm going to do the agility build and I'm going to go shotguns and fists or something. It's just like there's only a handful of ways you can really play through it. Uh, Darkness Falls is the same way, but when I play the next my dar next Darkness Falls series, I'm going to do something a little different. I'm going to take the... Uh, let's go to this road. I'm going to take the uh, the class books and I'm going to throw them out. I think I think Kane said that he's only going to have one for the next version of Darkness Falls. So starting class book, I'm just going to throw it away. I'm going to have no classes at all. And I'm going to force myself in a progression mode where I have to take the classes in order. So And of course the road just ends. Um, so, um, I have to take the farmer class first, because that's the first one on the list, right? So, once I get enough, uh, pages, I gotta take that. And then I have to master the farmer class. And we're gonna go along that way, and I can, I, I have to take a class and then master it out before I can take the next one. 
see how far we can get that way. It should be pretty interesting, I think. It should be a really nice, difficult challenge. Um, especially since we're just going to be running with, like, the base skills for most of the time. Now, you know, most of the stuff is, is acquirable through the base skills. It just takes a little longer sometimes. So all your workbenches are acquirable. The forges are all acquirable. Um, uh, what else? Um, yeah, coil rifles and stuff are all acquirable acquirable through the base skills, as are, you know, your weapons and things like that. And basic farming, all that's acquirable. Um, I should really check the map, see where we're going here. I bet you we passed it. Nope, we're almost at Bob's. We'll go this way. Um, so yeah, um, so that should be kind of interesting. But, uh, we'll see. Maybe, my, maybe my, uh, maybe my thoughts will change by, this, by the time I, it's, uh, Darkness Falls is stable for seven days to die. So we'll see how that goes. All right, so here's Bob. We should be able to find a shopping cart in this town. I mean, the cars are also a good way to tell the textures are loaded properly, but... Because I'm not really noticing anything different with... The door is fine. Oh, that may have fixed it. What a wonderful day. It is a wonderful day if the textures are fixed, man. Uh, can I see your inventory? What do you have for me today? Anything interesting? Night vision goggles. Generic schematics. Military fiber. We don't really need a military fiber schematic. Um, I don't, I don't expect he's going to have anything we need. It's a lot of gunpowder, but we got tons. Air filter landmines. You know what? I was thinking too that my next Darkness Falls series should be, um, or my next um, regular Seven Days to Die series should be. I think I should buy these. Come back grab tomorrow. My we get new I'll be back in a second. It should be. Um, hang on. That's gotta hurt. It's gotta, because if it doesn't, I'm doing something wrong. All right, uh, let's talk to you. Let's get your bullet tips, less lead that I gotta go and get. Yeah, it's a little chunky. Yeah, it looks like the car textures are all fine too. So it looks like that did it. Taking the texture streaming off. Although it's a little chunky, but I think once everything's loaded in the area, it'll be, um, I'll get far less lag. But I've been getting, like the further, like the longer I go in the games, um, or in the game, the more chunky I notice things become. And I think it's just because I got more of the world loaded, I don't know. Uh, do I, I don't need, need anything from you. Although if you've got lead, I'll take that. No. And I don't think there's anything I want. I could take a shopping cart and put it down, but... Oh, thanks. Alright, let's get rolling. Should really be using the shotgun for this. What are you shooting at? Is it a wandering horde? Oh, fuck it is! Ha! <laughs> How did I not see you guys? Come on, get over here! That's interesting to know that he backs up from the shotgun. I wonder if that was, um... I wonder why he'd be backing up. That's nice to know. I don't know whether it was because he was getting partially electrocuted, or... How did I not... I guess he must have just come around the corner. Oh, did you guys break in the back? Did they break in here somewhere? Don't see anybody. I hear you. Oh, fucking stop banging on that. Let's just go check over here real quick and see if they broke in the back. No. That's so weird. Let's just 
go around back, take care of this guy. Then we're going to get out of this town. I think that's the road right there that leads out. So let's go... Oi! That was the... Little present from the guards, I see. Three gunpowder. Well, we'll take it. Oh, I'm sorry, I can't pass this up. Got a whole wave of zombies coming in to attack this place. I gotta do my job because the guards here aren't going to do theirs. Oh, one more. He's running now. He's like, fuck this shit. No one said there was going to be somebody with a coil rifle. Ooh, one more. Stomach shot. Oh, there's a spider monkey out there. There he is. Got him. So the horde must have gone... Must have come across this way. And I must have just caught the tail end of it. It's probably why there was only a couple of them that attacked me. That would make sense. Uh, let's just leave some of this out, and I should probably do this. Okay, let's get back on the road. Leave the shotgun up. We'll head out of town. How was I talking about before I was so rudely interrupted? Uh, something about uh, the next series. Um, I can't remember. You know me. Uh, but yeah, so... I think I will do a regular series. It won't be very long. Maybe like 35 episodes or something. How's the... Yeah, you know what? Thank you, Mean Mad Mike. It looks like my texture issue is solved. But of course, now that I say that I'll get to the next town, the textures are all be fucked up. But we'll see how that's actually a thing. Um, but yeah, so I think that'll be like a, like a 35 episode series. Because there's a point where you reach in regular darkness or a regular uh, seven days to die where your base is functioning. And you just know that there's no point because the um, the zombies there's a whole other town here the zombies aren't going to really be able to do anything to you okay let's that's the main road but let's go through the town here looks like it's pretty spread out so we're looking for books I wanted just a small library I don't want one of those big huge ones where I gotta go up the stairs and go up to the top and yeah see there's the shopping cart perfectly fine oh my god thank you Thank you for that. I probably could have searched for that myself, but I did do I did do a little bit of searching. I was probably just looking for the wrong thing. Actually, let's grab a couple of... Well, I want to grab... Yeah, let's grab some free boxes from this place. There's a bear there. I got her, don't worry. Ooh, I'll take this guy. You get him. I'll, I got the loot. Don't worry. I'm gonna make you my bitch. I got it. Don't worry. I got this guy. All right. Let's grab some quick loot out of here. So this place is always the best. One of the, not the best, but one of the best places to loot early game. I find simply because there's this, the sheer number of boxes that are here, plus um. Eat, like the the lack in zombies. So there's nothing really we want. We'll take those two. Leave that. I'm not really worried about what's in here. He says, but then starts to listen for Bernie boys. Oh fuck! Getting these minor lag spikes as shit loads in. Plus there's lead here too if you want it. Jump across here. Grab this one. Eh, three grenades. You know what? I should have brought some grenades today. Oh, I got grenades on me. Never mind. Maybe we'll roll one in there then. Alright, let's get this stuff. There's three boxes here. Four boxes. So once again, more free stuff. Like, I, the one thing I have to say is some of these POIs, the amount of free loot they give you is... Um concerning at best like it's it really shouldn't be this scrap that take those 
Because this one you can do as long as you can stealth. Some of these are more difficult. This one was pretty easy. Sometimes you have up to four zombies in here. But this one only had the one. So, I mean, like, for the number of boxes that we got here. Crack a book. And we can just scrap these guys. I did click scrap. I think I'm good in there. I'll just use that. We don't need the brass. We'll just leave it. Um, another book. Crack a book up here. Scrap that. Definitely taking the plastic. I guess I should be more um, self-conscious about um, plastic and stuff and just make sure I take it all the time. Let's just scrap these as well. What do we got in here? I don't know why. I'm, I, I got so much shit at home. But the lead's always welcome. That did not scrap. Okay, so then once you've got this part done, and I'm sure you guys know this if you haven't played, or if you've played this game, but like right here is where the uh, all the workstations are. So like, if you find this POI early game, it is so worth just raiding it. Because even if these are all broken, you can still break them down for resources. You know, there's just so much shit here. A couple of gun store boxes, a couple of, um, Ah, what am I going to say? A couple of gun store, a couple of, uh, passing gas, uh... Really? You get the machine gun. Hey! See what I made? See? It's a delete button. See that? Pretty cool, huh? Alright, let's just keep moving. Um, yeah, so it's a really free, like, uh, a place where you can get pretty much free resources to start. Now, it's always better to loot it, I mean, like, nice to loot early game, but it's also always better to loot it a little later in the game. Is that an ammo pile? It's an ammo pile. There's gonna be guys right here, though. Oh, one. That's gotta hurt. This place is not bad either, but it's tough to get through. We're not here for that today. But I will take the ammo. Not a lot, but we'll take it. Okay, not looking like there's much here besides houses. Wait, that's the... that's not the house on the hill one, that's just a regular house. That's the safe house. Lots of food in there, which we don't need. Oh, there's this... there's that castle! This would be like the most awesome base if you had like three or four players. I should really run this castle. I don't want I just don't want to do it today cuz here's the thing. I want to wait till we get a laser weapon because I don't want what happened in the Wii Fight building to happen in one of those buildings that I want to clear because we just couldn't I mean we kind of finished the Wii Fight building. We almost didn't weren't able to finish it because of that uh radiated behemoth. Um but, yeah, so, like, I don't want to go into another one of those big ones and not be able to finish the damn thing because we run into something that we can't kill. This place has always got lots of nice tools and stuff in it. Not inter that, interested in that. I want books. So I should stay on target here. Oh. See, now that the shopping carts aren't uh, mistextured, <laughs> I can't see them. So this town is a whole lot of nothing. So we're going to head, yeah, see this is straight north, so there's nothing really. Ah, oh, man. Well, this was a bust. I guess maybe we go back to the other town and try and uh, do that big library then. We got to clear all the cops in the bottom. Alright, let's go do that. 
All right, so I tried to, try to take an off-road here. There's the library right over there. I'm hoping this isn't so bad. I took the main road back this time to get some time back because we're going to be getting here later in the day and it's like that building is kind of a full clear. I don't want to be clearing it at night. But at least if the bad guys are loaded before nightfall comes, we should still be kind of okay. Is this one? Okay, that place. That's the drug house or whatever that is. Where is the... Uh, there it is. Oh, the tower. So that's the Skylon or whatever it is. Tower. The, the other one should be right beside it. Close to it. Right? The library? Should it not? Wait, am I in the right place? I'm pretty sure I am. Yeah, that's the right tower. So why am I not seeing the library? There it is. Ah, there we go. All right, we need 120 books. We've got to clear the bottom floor, get to the top, murder everything. I'm pretty sure we got enough ammo, unless we come across something that we can't kill. Which, knowing me, is probably pretty likely. I think we went into the bottom floor here before, did we not? Yeah, because there's a demo explosion right here. I kind of remember being here. All right, let's drop uh, most of this stuff off in the bike, actually. Three, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, whatever. Good enough. Actually, let's make it ten. Drop the money in there as well. Which I can't anyway. Fuck it, make it eleven. Good enough. All right, let's do this. Let's try and snipe as many as we can early. Good thing we got some good power on this. So we're zombies are all on always run right now. So I won't be able to tell the difference between a uh, regular zombie, which we shouldn't be getting too many of anyway. Is that a guy? No, it's not a guy. I can't see a head here. Wait. Is that it? can't keep this thing straight. I've even got that uh, bipod mod on it for recoil reduction. Doesn't seem to be working very well. Okay, you're lying down. I can see you. Question is, can I get to you before you wake up? That's the guy outside. Well, 2,500 hit points. Sorry, zero hit points. So that's the cop room. I don't think the grenades are going to cut it. I could be wrong. I think they do like 240 a pop. I can't see your head. That was it. I took a guess there. Okay, we're going to worry about those guys in a second. Let's clear the outside so we can run around with a, like a chicken with our head cut off inside here. That is... Should be able to kill this guy in one shot. Yeah. The cop, I know we definitely can't. Actually, I think that's the police there over on that side. All these doors are open. Oh, hello. Can I see your head? Extinguish his light. I think that's your head right there. Okay, it's the people in there I'm hearing. Another Bernie over here. It's nice that their heads are all turned towards us. 
getting super lucky here. Okay, so this room's cleared, so I guess then uh, east, west, what, whatever side, this side's clear. <laughs> God, I'm not a freaking soldier. Where are they? East. No, west. Wait, just, they're over here. Ah, uh, never mind. I got them. That guy's pretty hefty. Anybody in here? Yep. Um, that's the ass end. Okay, that side's clear. That's the police room. Well, I mean... How bad could it really be? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. God, I don't want to be those guys. Didn't get them all, but... Pretty near got most of them, though. And we got shit for a reward for it. Nice, this guy's the guy out the street. What's up, buddy? Yeah, we'll take that, we'll take that. We don't need those. Actually, we'll just scrap these. We can probably just scrap this, too. I should just start scrapping most stuff. Alright. Um, um, it's not a word. That's locked. Don't hear any burning zombies in here. Doesn't mean they ain't here, though. Now, I think we looted the whole... We didn't. I thought we looted the whole... Oops. What am I doing? Just gotta scrap that. I thought we looted this whole basement. Maybe I just kind of went in and then was like you know, ah, oh, there's not enough here. Or I couldn't, I don't know, I can't even remember now. Yeah, man. Don't need the paper. Nothing else on this side. Let's go check this side out. Locked. Yeah. Probably quiet. Except for this guy. Posing no real threat. Alright, well, let's check what's in here. Oh, this side I did do. Yeah, I didn't do all of it, I guess. Don't need either of those things. Actually, you know what? Just in case we get some kind of laceration or something today. Oh, hey. I don't know if that's a... I think that was a respawn. Ratchet. Yep, definitely respawns. It's weird. The bigger POIs... Even Kane mentioned it, that they're, um... The way that the uh, respawns happen. Well... I'm not going to get to use the grenades upstairs, so we might as well just use them now. Get your feet out of the way. God damn it. These are military guys, so we better uh, make sure we have enough in there. Okay, people. How do we do? Almost got all of them. Oh, shit. Of course.
Well, that looks like a... Uh, Hey, dude. 10,000 hit points. You're gonna feel that in the morning. Come on. He didn't stand a chance. We gotta get upstairs, man. Or we're not gonna get uh, shit done here. Ooh, that's not a bad... Uh, Little hall. Oh, hey. God, I love this SMG. Okay, we got the bookshelves. Did we get all this room last time? Chainsaw. We did. Okay, I guess we're going upstairs. Um, where is the staircase? Right here, right? It was not. Where is the staircase then? Not there. Over here? All right, and you keep the SMG out since it's got uh, the speed we need. Oh, hey! Let's have some lunch. And maybe drop one of these guys. Let's go use the coil rifle because it hits harder. <laughs> Take the demonic essence. Don't waste my time. I'm not quite at the top yet, so this guy's probably on the stairs that I'm hearing. That was a little better. Having problems with my hands today. Actually, I've been having problems with my hands for the past few days, getting good control with the mouse. Should probably readjust my mouse settings again. All right, well, here we go. Um, that's another screamer. Okay, here they are, They're spawning in now. At least this corner's quiet. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Hope that screamer doesn't come upstairs. And you know what? When we go to leave here, I'm going to completely forget she's down there. No, I won't, because she's coming upstairs. Thanks for making it easy for me. Appreciate it. That was a dog. Is that a head? I know I'm on fire. Well, let's make sure we're reloaded. And let's hope that when we come back around this way that they haven't respawned on this side. God, I move faster sneaking than I do walking.
take that now. Not just for the wellness, but for the... Oh shit, we're gonna... Fuck it. Got them both. That was a double headshot. Double headshot. Okay, my days... Even if we die here, I'm like, my days like made. I mean, it's not really if I die, but still, that's still... Ooh. Silent sleeper. That is your feet. We don't want feet, we want the head. Yeah, the common radiates are just like, yeah, fuck, whatever. I remember when they used to be scary. Wait, uh... What am I looking at here? Where's your head? It's in the wall. Well, that's not good. Alright, not too bad. The loot's terrible. I'll take that, though. No thanks. Uh, I got duct tape downstairs. Scrap that. I, think, uh, well, I don't know. We need the oil. I don't know why I'm taking it. Alright, I think we got everybody on the lower floor. Alright, let's start. Ooh, these are empty. Did we clear this whole place already? Man, would this not be the worst thing in the world if we, like... If everything is empty up here? I mean, we need the XP anyway. Yeah, I think we did this whole thing. Crap. Serves me right for not checking. Let's see if I can make this jump. You're damn right I can. Yeah, we did everything here. I better just double check this, though. Let me just go, go around and double check we got everything. And, yep, we do. Okay, well. That's another, uh, screamer. We needed the XP and the kills, though. Where are you, lady? I should probably let her scream, see what shows up. She's coming upstairs here. It's nighttime, I don't want to let her scream. All right, I'm gonna grab this shit and get home. Ah, yeah, not a lot. Ah, uh, well, whatever. Well, you think I would have known by the big crater up front that uh, this was already handled? Galleria. I think I, I'm gonna check the front of this place before we go. I think the Galleria has got. Um, is this the one I'm thinking of? No, I'm thinking of the, the train station. Yeah, there's one of the buildings that has some bookshelves right in the front doors. That's not it, though. All right, let's get back home. All right, we're back home. I'm going to see what we can sell here. Uh, let's just leave the stuff. Ah, uh, do I want to leave everything in the bike? No, nah, it's not. I don't think we're going to go out on a walkabout tomorrow. That was kind of a bust. It's I was really hoping soon. for more. You got here just in time. Did I? Uh, can I see your inventory? We don't... Well, let's hang on to you. Uh, I'm gonna hang on to the auger. It might be better than the one we have. Don't really need that. I think we might need that. I don't need you. Don't want those, eh? Um, hang on to that. Don't really need those. Can sell the silver. Pretty darn good price. Sell that. I know I probably had a die on it that I could use, but... I think I'm good here. That can go. This can go. All this can go. Alright, so not bad. I mean, we uh, we didn't Look, make out that great. Oh, wait. My day. 
Did I? I'm glad I could help you. Tell you what. Take these for somebody in need, because I don't need them. And I hope that's you it. get feeling better. 11, um... Actually, I want to see your inventory. She had 11, uh... Or sorry, I found 11 plastic parts, is what I'm thinking. Where is... Plastic will be under he resources? Yeah, you know, no such luck. Things turned up missing the other day. Yeah, it wasn't me. Nope, wasn't me. Don't, don't. Oh yeah, by the way, I replaced all this for her too. Gonna upgrade it to steel as well. Same as the uh, rails on the outside here. Just give it a better look. All right, so I'm gonna put all this stuff away. Maybe we take some quests tomorrow. Maybe we can find some half decent stuff with quests. I don't want to go. Like I mean, I guess. I could put all this stuff away tonight and then I could look on the map and see if there's any we didn't see any in that time I know we looked I think we looked at this one too we didn't see any libraries that's the art gallery I think no that's not the art gallery I don't know what that is not the library though so we could we could just go and look. I could look at these towns and see if I can find I mean, I don't know if there's a library here or not. This is the town that Jerudo was in for his playthrough where he started. I I don't know even know if there's a thing there. There's a whole town we haven't explored over here too. Well, how many pages did we get? 18. Wow. Yeah, maybe I'll restock an ammo and we'll go out again tomorrow. We've got another four days before the horde starts. I'm going to check the trader again when we go back down. Or I'll go back down and check the trader. But I'm going to drop all this shit off now and end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.